Good morning, guys. It is Sunday, March 25th, and I'm looking out my hotel room here. And I thought you guys might want to see how much snow fell yesterday. Look at that. Holy crap. And that's down here in Bland. It's not even up in the mountains. All right, I'm gonna shut this door because it's cold and I have no power to heat the room right now. All right, guys, so here's the story. Um, that is a ton of snow out there. I knew it was getting bad yesterday. Um, <clears throat> part of the reason I, I, I didn't do any video and A, it was getting hard to use the phone. It was real hard to use the phone, actually. But B, I was, I was a little scared out there, man. I, you know, I've, um, I've been through some rough weather before, but that was, that was probably the worst. That was the worst I've seen. And, uh, I just felt really thankful to get off that mountain. So I think looking at that car outside, I ought to tell you something that there is a ton of snow out there. Um, man, I need to go. I need, I need, I'm 40 miles from Parisburg right now. And I could do that in two days easy if it weren't for all this snow. Um, all this snow, you know, I was looking at gut hooks and I'm starting to pick out 10 mile days just to get there. Um, I don't know what to do. I still hadn't decided if I'm going to try to make a go of it this afternoon. Um, I was, uh, texting with Blackbeard and Opa and I think they're going to leave Parisburg today and just try to go five miles or something like that. Um, me, the first shelter I could make it to is only a couple miles. That's not far enough. There's another shelter at like nine miles. I could probably make it there. Um, but really almost what's the point? Um, it's just going to be wet and cold out there again. You know, one, the main reason I came into town yesterday rather than go to, um, that shelter, which was only a couple more miles was because I was so wet. I had everything I had on had soaked through and, um, I, I knew, I mean, I had some dry clothes to put on, but I knew that the clothes that I had would not even come close to drying for today. And um, it, it just became, you know, where I felt like it wasn't a safe situation. I'm not I'm not out here to, uh, to risk my neck too awful much. I mean, you know, I'll take a chance here and there, but, uh, you know, I want this to be fun. I don't want any kind of rescue operations to come and pull me out of the mountains. So I'm trying to be smart. Um, and I think, I think the smart move for me today is probably just not to go anywhere. Um, hopefully this power comes back on, man. I'd like to turn the heater on and really get my clothes dried out. There's no way to do laundry, but, um, you know, if I give it all day today, enough of that snow may melt this afternoon that it, I can actually, um, you know, do a couple twenties and get into Parisburg on, let's see, probably Wednesday morning. Tuesday night, something like that, um, probably Wednesday morning. Um, so yeah, just take Sunday off, just sit here and chill out. I've got um, a Circle K across the street that has a Dairy Queen. Um, if they open up today, it will be Burger City. And uh, man, I'm just gonna, I think at this point, I'm just gonna chill out here. If uh, things change, then I'll update this. If not, I'll probably show you guys around where I'm at a little bit and this video just won't get very long but anyway that's about it for the morning and uh i will talk to you soon well just talking to the owner of the hotel motel this is motel right here and this is a great place man the owner here is so cool he's like man you just stay as long as you need to he's flexible so if i get out of here today I get out of here today if not if not but he said he thinks the power is going to be on by lunchtime and uh the main thing is if you can see that circle k down there let's see see there i need that place to open back up so that i can get down there and do some resupply because what i have in my bag is practically inedible 
crap I bought at Ollie's. It's terrible. So I can get down there and at least get some food to, for a couple of days to get me to either Trent's Grocery or to get me all the way to Parisburg. But um, the shuttle guy who lives in town is buried in snow. He really can't get out today. Um, his wife works here also, and, and she seems to think that he'll probably be able to get it. Get me back up to the trail tomorrow. If not, I'll just walk it. It's only four miles. And uh, I'll be definitely be back on the trail tomorrow, but maybe later on today, maybe just enough to, to get to that next shelter. You know, I may get on this evening and uh, just walk to that next shelter. Uh, it depends on if the power. If the power ain't gonna come back on, I need to get out of here because, man, you can't even go to the bathroom around here. So, anyway, that's the State of the Union right now. But I tell you what, despite all the, the hardship of all this snow, man, is it beautiful out here. I love this little deck here, man. You just sit out here and watch the cars go by and get some sun. A little gazebo over here. I love this hotel. I love to just be going north and on the interstate and pull over and find this place and stay a couple nights. But, all right. Well, I'll talk to you guys in a bit. This here is how you keep your Dr. Peppers cold when you don't have power. <laughs> you fill your trash can full of snow. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. It is uh, Sunday about 6 o'clock, and I'm still sitting in this hotel. Um, we have still not got power back, so <sighs> whatever. Still hoping it comes back on, man. I'd love to get a shower before I go to bed tonight. Um, got a shuttle lined up for 7.30 in the morning, and I'm just going to go out there and plug away at it. Uh, see how far I can get each day. Um, Parisburg's 40 miles. You know, that, that'd be an easy two days for me. Um, it's not gonna be an easy two days now. <laughs> I'm afraid it's gonna be a difficult three days, but we'll uh, we'll see how it goes, man. Maybe the, the sun did more work today than, than I anticipate, and I may get out there and just be able to roll. So um, that that's, that's the hope. Um, but regardless, it's just gonna be good to get back out on trail. Uh, sitting around this hotel all day has, <sighs> it's been pulling teeth, man. I was able to take a nice long nap. Um, Dairy Queen did open up, so I went over there and just got a ton of food. I ate till, man, I ate way, way, way too much, but it was delicious, so whatever. Um, I may go back over there tonight. I don't know yet. Um, I think they're open till eight, so I got a couple hours to sit here and digest it and decide if I want more. Um, but anyways, that's going to just about do it for today. <clears throat> well, that didn't quite do it for today. Um, I did want to say that uh, I've really enjoyed reading your guy, you guys' comments today. Um, you've definitely kept me company. It's been, it's been a long day, man, just sitting around this hotel room. And uh, I don't know, without you guys on YouTube, I don't know what I would have done. I'd be going crazy right now. So uh, thank you very much for for the support and the comments, and, um, and you guys are great. Um, one thing I also need to mention too is uh, my battery, my uh, 20,000 milliamp battery is about half discharged right now. And depending on, you know, I'm, I'm having to charge this phone every day. So if I run out of battery, you know, if, if it takes more than say three days to, to get to, um, Parisburg, I'm gonna run out of battery. And you know, that's that's not gonna be good, but there's really nothing I can do about it. Um, you, you don't anticipate being snowed in like this and it happens. So just a heads up that there, it's possible there may be a dark day where I can't record video. You know, I'm gonna have to keep the phone somewhat operable and um, the video will have to suffer if, if my, you know, if I can't move and it's gonna take a long time to get to Parisburg, you know, the video is definitely going to suffer because keeping the phone, keeping um, the gut hooks app going and uh, keeping, uh, you know, my line of communication out is more important than, than the video, unfortunately. Um, but, you know, power could still come on tonight and I could still get it charged up and things would be great. It, you know, things may not even, you may not even notice that, you know, there may not be no days skipped. So um, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. But, um, 
plan on being on the trail before 8 in the morning, and um, I will see you guys then. Have a good evening.